Alright, imagine a world with no greenhouse gases, no radiation, and a clean source of energy. A safe planet that can provide energy without any harm. Good news! In a few years from this day, humans will have made it possible by creating the largest nuclear fusion reactor. Want to know more about it? I suggest you stay until the end of the video, but before that, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and click the bell button to keep you updated with amazing videos like this one. Humans are living because of the accessible energy provided, and scientists are aiming to provide energy to people without limit and harming the planet. The goal is to use nuclear fusion to make it possible. Nuclear fusion is the process of using the sun as a source of energy and build a fusion reactor to form a power generator that will generate electricity by using heat from nuclear fusion reactions. It processes the power of the sun and the stars. The two atoms of hydrogen combine for a new atom of helium with one neutron, meaning it has a lower energy state. ITER or the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor will be the most expensive engineering project ever undertaken by man. The global's most advanced and largest nuclear fusion reactor will cost from 25 billion to 65 billion and is currently located in St. Paul Les Durans, France. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor or ITER is a joint project between different countries starting from the European Union, China, India, Japan, South Korea, Russia, and the US. Building the biggest nuclear fusion reactor took a lot of delays because of several hindrances. There were a lot of comments about extreme costs and the ambitious goal of the project. The construction of ITER started in 2013, but then 2020 became a starting point for the engineers to make it possible to make the assembly. In July 2020, scientists began joining the various components provided by the partner countries. The aim for ITER was to build a smaller model of a star inside a laboratory that they would be able to control. For that to happen, they built a 23,000 ton cylinder where intense supercomputers Conducting magnets will attempt to keep a 15 million degree Celsius plasma contained for fusion to occur. The ITER is also known as the largest puzzle in the world, with its estimated 1 million components and the parallel installation and integration of plant systems such as radio, frequency heating, fuel cycle, cryogenic, cooling water, vacuum control, and high electric voltage. The challenge building the ITER is to make physics work. How two small particles, hydrogen isotope tritium and hydrogen isotope deuterium, will create fusion without the two charges repelling and create a strong nuclear force. The heart of the largest nuclear fusion reactor is the device called tokamak. It is a magnetic field coil to contain plasma. There are 18 coils where each is the size of a six-story building and weighs 6,000 metric tons the most powerful superconductive magnets design. The coal is composed of the central solenoid, toroidal field magnet, and poloidal field magnet. This allows the plasma to be superheated to more than 15 million degrees Celsius. The nuclear fusion reactor was expected to take at least 10 years and ITER had planned to test its first plasma in 2020 and the full version by 2023. But the schedule now is to test the plasma in 2025 and the full version in 2035. The first fusion device for ITER to be used is to produce net energy. The official calculations state that 50 megawatts of heating water will be injected into the plasma to create fusion fusion power for 400 second pulses. ITER will be the first to achieve a self-heating plasma and is expected to generate 10 times more heat than is put in. It will also use a significant amount of electrical energy when it's running to power magnets and scientific machines. But it aims to be a proof of concept of a large-scale fusion, not a design for a commercial fusion reactor. ITER will be an exclusive source of clean energy and will become a great way to save the planet. And everything going on that is harming not only nature, but the things living above it. What do you think about this idea? 
Tell me your answers in the comment section below. Make something that could change Earth is something we should be inspired by. No matter whether you are a scientist or not, it is good to make something to make this world a better place. This is all for now and I'll see you in the next video.